voices and sounds of spring, we get to a brand new piece of music. So along with the Lorraine C. Lippert Young Soloist Competition, we run another competition for young emerging composers. And this year, uh, we have a great uh, piece of music by Bradley Fletcher, who has just completed his master's degree at Carnegie Mellon University, where he studies with Nancy Galbraith. Um, and rather than me talk about it, I'm going to introduce Bradley here to tell you a little bit about his piece. Bradley, won't you come up? Hi, I'm Bradley Fletcher, and before I get into this, I just want to take a moment to uh, thank Daniel Curtis and the uh, uh, Pittsburgh Philharmonic, not only for playing my piece, but for just providing this uh, wonderful environment where we can introduce you to orchestral music. So, uh, thank you. So, uh, my piece is basically my pandemic piece. It, um, mm -hmm. I wrote it specifically during the lockdowns, and when you're in this lockdown, you have like this flurry of emotions that ranges between hope and dread and sometimes a cautious optimism. And you hear all these uh, themes in this piece, and often they state themselves very clearly. But there's also points in this piece where they all kind of swell together. It's like um, when you're in seclusion, your thoughts start racing, you jump from one thing to the next, and you're not exactly sure what to make of the situation. And I just wanted to mention that the title is uh, One Equal Temper for Heroic Hearts, and it comes from the end of Alfred Lord Tennyson's poem, Ulysses. Though much is taken, much abides. And though we are not now that shape which in old days moved earth and heaven, that which we are, we are. One equal temper of heroic hearts, made weak by time and fate, but strong and well, to strive, to seek, to find, and not to yield. Thank you. Thank you. 